everybody, Mike from Enviroscape LA. And I've got a really spe special treat for you today. I have, uh, in a, gonna be talking in a few uh, seconds, a few moments, uh, Maurice Levin, owner of Jurassic Gardens Nursery. He is absolutely the world's most passionate, just loves this special plant, endangered species called Encephalardos. Encephalardos typically come from Africa. They look like palm trees, but they're drought tolerant. So you can have your cake and you can eat it too. Uh, they're an endangered species. So Maurice actually goes to Africa and to other different parts of the world and actually collects the seeds and he grows them from seed for our special area. And he's the most passionate person I've ever met and I'm really honored and really pleased. I just want you to take a look though at this truck full of encephalardos. This is his commitment to excellence. And you know, it's an amazing thing. And I'm gonna have Maurice talk to us a little bit about the encephalardos plants. So without any further ado, Maurice Levin. Um, thank you, Mike. Uh, what's exciting is the chance to work not just with collectors who uh, like putting these in their gardens uh, and having the plants for their special uh, nature, the fact that they come from other countries, but that when you grow one of these in your garden, you're actually preserving an endangered species in your own home. Uh, but the landscapers like Mike Garcia of Enviroscape actually are now committed to helping preserve these plants in their clients' gardens and designing cycads uh, like the Encephalardos into their uh, landscapes. I mean, just just as a just one that's just coming off the truck here, this is an Encephalardus natalensis. And if you look at this plant and you think how glorious it can be, it's a very structural plant uh, that emerges, uh, in which the leaves emerge from this trunk. It's a critically endangered species in South Africa. It's native country and by planting something like this this is a seven or eight year old plant in your garden not only do you have something that is uh, a, li literally a, a living sculpture a visual sculptural plant in your garden but you're also preserving an endangered species and uh, with so many more species every year becoming endangered it's incumbent upon us not just to take care of plants in the wild but actually to preserve these plants by growing them and propagating them. And we actually uh, grow these plants into larger specimens so that we can produce seed from the cones. And uh, it's a pretty exciting thing. And it's exciting to work with landscapers like Mike and Enviroscape who actually take the time, effort and energy to plan these into their landscapes. And so they and their